Edmonton's Cresha Turner is turning up the heat with her sophomore album release, Tropic Electric. Her evolution into the music biz has been a smooth and patient process. Hard to believe that in 2005, all of this was just a dream. Cresha, such a pleasure to catch up with you again. And those at home that don't really know this, I discovered you. Yes. Brad Kelly was a part of the team that picked me to win the Bounce Showdown. I picked her to win the Bounce Showdown, is what she's saying. <laughs> exactly. Well, okay, so rewind. Uh, 2005, that would have been the yes. year. And uh, here you come, full circle. You have this uh, new record, Tropic Electric, and an unbelievable sounding album. Uh, so you've come a long way. You've worked yeah. very, very hard. I so, I, you know, it's kind of tough to sum up the last uh, six years, but uh, I'm sure we can do that right now. But yeah, it's just been a lot of hard work. I'm really excited to finally have my second album out because it's even been three years since my first album, right. Passion. That was 2008. Mm -hmm. And um, the most exciting part about this album is the fact that I got to take the steering wheel. I had so much creative control in the creation process of this album that, I don't know, I feel like I am really, for the first time, showcasing me, how I hear music, how I write music, you know, so I'm just excited to be able to present this now for everybody to take in and, you know, hopefully love just as much as I love it. Yeah, we love it. Her second single, Don't Call Me Baby, hit Canada's top 10 pop charts and was well received in the U.S. as well. With that, Canada took notice. Leading up to the 2009 Juno Awards, Turner appeared in a number of heavily aired Nestle Kit Kat Senses commercials, which featured the singer and her first hit song, Bounce With Me. Introducing Kit Kat Senses. This made Turner a hot commodity and she needed to step her game up on stage. Well, honestly, I still get nervous before every performance. And I still get nervous when, you know, I'm playing new music because, you know, I, I'm sitting there thinking, like, I hope they like it. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So and I, I don't want that to change. Like, the moment that I stop getting nervous before shows, I don't think I should be doing this anymore. All the joy that's inside, baby, you're so different. So there's no complacency with you. You obviously feel like you're sharp and on your toes. You yes. mentioned three years between records. Yes. Are you consciously thinking of that next one now? I'm not because and a lot of people ask, you know, why such a big gap? Yeah. But I've been busy the whole time. And the reason it took so much longer to come out with my second album is simply, you know, a lot of pop artists are just given the songs. So, you know, you're given a song, you take it, go in the studio a couple months, in and out, mm -hmm. good to go. Yeah. But because I was there for the creation from ground up, every song from starting to end um it just took a lot longer let's show everybody the uh record so they know exactly what we're talking about here there it is tropic electric Cresha turner's second album and uh, it's so great to see you again after all these years you look fantastic you're sounding you great so and uh you know i, I don't want to take too much credit <laughs> you know. Brad kelly shaw tv capital region